Hi there, I'm Joshua Finn from j and Aerospace, and this is the Crow. This is not an airplane that I manufacture. This is manufactured by Marius Rona out of Poland. This is one of the neatest, uh, most beginner-friendly, high-performance indoor gliders I've ever seen. So this airplane requires no sanding on your part to assemble it, other than sanding the uh, tabs off of the fuselage. The wings and tail are ready to go out of the box. All you have to do is glue in the wing spar, sand it down, join the wing tips, attach the wing to the fuselage, attach the tail to the fuselage, balance it, and start trimming. The reason that is significant is this airplane weighs around 12 to 15 grams. It's about a 27 inch wingspan, so that means this is a very lightly loaded glider and it flies beautifully. There will be some links in the description. If you don't see them, ping me and then I'll add them in the description. Uh, but the bottom line, there are lots of videos out there of these flying in European contests, uh, flying indoors so you can see what they're really capable of. Uh, I have failed to get indoor footage because every time I do, we're all too busy fighting over the planes to, you know, flying them to actually waste our time. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> that sounds terrible. But to take time to video them, it's not a waste, but... Anyway, I apologize to y'all. We have not been videoing these like we should. Uh, so, the airplane is $25 on our website. Includes all the ne basic necessities to get it going. Uh, we will have some carbon fuselages, so you can actually uh, upgrade these to a carbon fuselage if you, if you purchase the carbon fuse. And then you'll have an even nicer airplane, which is pretty amazing, because this thing is awesome as it is. So, what we'll do is we'll throw it up here a little bit and you can see what it's like. Uh, but what I can tell you is under about a 30 foot ceiling, you can get uh, mid 30 second flights with a little bit of work. You do have to trim it out, so like I've got some washout on this wing tip. Uh, you can see it's bent up very slightly. I've got a fair amount of right rudder. I've got uh, down elevator trim on this side, up elevator on this side to give me a snappier transition, etc. Uh, but one of the cool things about this airplane is if it does stall out, it tail slides and then pops back into the glide anyway, so long as you've done some of those basic trim maneuvers. Yeah, so. our, our contractors were doing everything they could to uh, yeah. make it where it wouldn't fly right. And, and it flew anyway. Any way that they threw it, it as would I shall now snap right into a... Hilarious, so... I mean... It just goes anyway. So I intentionally threw it into a stall and off it goes. Uh, if you can't tell from that flat glide, this is a true low drag airfoil, deep under camber with a little bit of up sweep on the front. Uh, makes it very, very nice. And tail slide and it still recovers and off it goes. There we go. Do that again. Throw it up. Are you going to catch it? Nope, it's ahead of you now.
If you can't tell these things are fun, you should get one. I do have somewhat limited supplies in stock until we get past the trade embargo going on with Europe. But once that gets going, uh, we'll be able to get more of these in stock. So please join us on the flying field and try these out. They're pretty awesome. Hi, I'm Josh Finn. This is Hope. We are J&H Aerospace. If you like this video, hit the like button. Also, how about subscribe to our channel and check out jhaerospace.com for new free flight products and all of the tooling that you'll need to build them. Thanks for watching.